Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, That Model Railway Guy, for just a quick little update video uh, because I've had a fair bit of exciting news recently. So, firstly, as some of you already know, I've been nominated in the Hornby Magazine Awards for the Best YouTuber category, uh, which is absolutely amazing and also just a little bit surreal. Uh, if you haven't already, please do go and vote for me uh, if you enjoy what I do here channel. Uh, something like this may seem kind of trivial, but uh, believe it or not, these sorts of things are, are really important when it comes to talking to the big manufacturers or companies, and also just helping to expand the channel in general so that I can keep making the content better and better for you guys. Uh, as always, there's some very large and some very popular channels also in the running, so uh, it's definitely tough competition, but uh, who knows? Uh, anything could happen. Uh, like I say, if you do enjoy what I do here on the channel, uh, please do go and vote for me. Uh, I've put a link down in the description, and I'll also put it in the comments as the, as the pinned comment too uh, below. So uh, yeah, you can vote for me on the Hornby Magazine website. Uh, just follow that link, and you've got to scroll right to the bottom of the page for the actual voting. Uh, there isn't long left either. I, I think it's just over a week, maybe. Uh, I think it's next Sunday that the voting closes. So please do get your votes in as soon as you can. Uh, it literally takes 30 seconds seconds to do, uh, so it would be very much appreciated. And uh, for everyone that does vote for me, uh, thank you so, so much. Uh, I really do appreciate it, and uh, yeah, you're all awesome. Uh, okay, next bit of exciting news is that recently the channel has hit 25,000 subscribers, which is just absolutely mind-blowing. Um, again, not wanting to sound like a broken record here, but uh, thank you to all of you. Whether you have just subscribed to the channel recently, or whether you've been here for a while, uh, whether you comment on every single video, or whether you've never commented at all, uh, I really do appreciate each and every single one of you. And uh, honestly, it's still surprising that people care about what I do here. Um, normally when I hit these big milestones I like to do some sort of event, uh, I'm not entirely sure what that will be yet. Um, usually I, I do a live stream but the modular layout which you can see uh, is actually running at the moment. Uh, this is all about to be dismantled and packed up for its very first exhibition appearance. Um, more on that in, uh, in just a moment. Uh, but yeah, uh, so probably not a live stream unless I really delayed it or pushed it back. Uh, so maybe I'll just get to work on editing the next series of videos of work on this layout uh, because I've made a lot of progress on it uh, since the last set of videos. And uh, yeah, hopefully I'll release that as soon as I can uh, because I know you're all eager to see more of the modular model railway. Um, on that note, the layout, which is also known as Pitley Steam Railway, is going to be attending its very first exhibition really, really soon. Uh, it's going to be at the Spa Valley Railway in Tunbridge Wells for their model railway weekend on the 23rd and 24th of September. Uh, that's this coming weekend, so less than a week away. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you want to come down and see the layout in person and, and see all of that progress that I've made, uh, which hasn't been seen in the videos yet, um, there's actually several new modules which uh, haven't been seen on screen yet so there's 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 lots to see uh yeah so if you would like to come and see that uh, then please do come along uh, i'll be around i'll be on this lab all weekend too so uh please do stop by if you want to say hello and and of course there are loads of amazing layouts that are going to be on display uh thornbury hill is going to be there which is always fantastic to see uh if you haven't seen it before uh, it's a really fun layout to watch uh pesto is making a welcome return as well which is a, a lovely O-gauge western themed terminus, uh, again with uh, lots of shunting and trains running in and out. Uh, I believe there are some 009 layouts too, for those of you that like your narrow gauge. Uh, the Lego guys are coming back again. Uh, they, I think they've got a couple of layouts this year, and of course they always build their incredible locos out of Lego as well, which is, is fascinating. Uh, I'm also told that none other than Simon Kohler is going to be there to open the exhibition as well, so that's going to be really exciting. And that is literally just the very tip of the iceberg. Uh, there are loads of layouts and traders too that I haven't mentioned. And don't forget as well that there is a two train service running on the Spa Valley Railway all weekend as well, with the exhibition itself spreading across three of the stations. So so there's going to be loads to, uh, to check out. Uh, if you want more information, then please do head over to the Spa Valley Railway website. Uh, again, I'll put a link to that down in the description. And you can see all of the layouts that are attending, all of the trains.
traders that are attending as well and you can also book your tickets in advance if you want to as well uh, it's going to be a really awesome weekend so please do come along if you can uh, yeah it's going to be great so like i said that's my little update uh lots of exciting things going on uh, and just to recap Please do go vote for me in the Hornby Magazine Awards. Uh, that would be really, really awesome. Thank you again to all 25,000 of you who have subscribed to the channel. And uh, yeah, if all 25,000 of you went and voted for me in the awards, uh, that would be a lot of vote. That would be 25,000 votes right there. Uh, maths, that's not my strong point. Uh, hopefully I'll see some of you at the exhibition later this week. Uh, but that's it for now, uh, just as the 9F runs out almost as if on cue, but uh, yeah. That's it for now, so thank you so much for watching everybody and I'll see you in another video really, really soon. Bye.